Hey what's up everyone, Thunderbob here, and I'm checking out uh, Diablo 2 Resurrected Alpha again. This is a Blizzard Sorceress. Um, so this is pretty simple. It's based around Blizzard. And you get Blizzard, plus it's three synergies. Hold Mastery, though you don't necessarily need to max this out. Uh, a lot of people don't. I just, this is a, a full cold build. I'm not going to the other synergies, or the other skill trees really, so I maxed it. Uh, I usually get whichever armor I want to work with. Usually I'll go with Shiver, but it's kind of your choice. Uh, Lightning, usually one point in Static. I'll get down to Teleport. Energy Shield's also optional. I could have backed off on Cold Mastery and got Energy Shield. And I usually put one point in Warmth. It's not really necessary, but give you some increased mana regeneration. And uh, this is kind of the same build as my Orb Sorceress, I just respect her. So some of this is a little bit better for an Orb Sorceress. Uh, particularly like uh, the robes here. Which, actually I don't think it's supposed to be able to spawn with Frozen Orbs, so I'm not completely sure how that's working. Yep, so that's what I'm working with. And we're gonna check this out. We're probably gonna uh, go through and kill Andariel. And, and actually, on this character, uh, I've already killed her, so I, I know the path. And you know, I didn't play much with the Blazer back in the day. I always liked uh, Orb better. So kind of curious how this works. I understand like this is kind of like the cookie cutter like first build most people go with. Um, but I always enjoyed orb better. Um, I know this can do more theoretical damage but I was never as good like at aiming it and controlling it for some reason. I'm using it on a single target. Kind of dumb. I'm really not running into too much. Too much right now. And those are fire me. Yeah, it's pretty nice. Fourteen thousand damage. You do have a cooldown on it, so you can't just spam it. And then usually, and I should have already had this up. Yeah, glacial spike, which you can have on the left, which has like a little bit of AOE. Uh, or alternatively, you, know, you get Ice Blast, which does more damage, but is a single target. I need mana. I don't know if I like the new Blizzard art. I feel like, uh, it doesn't look like so much as, like, Blizzard as, like, like, spikes of ice. Yeah, I'm not sure if I'm loving that new art. So, some things I think, uh, really translate well, and then some I think they could probably use just a little bit of work. Yeah, I'm just gonna back out and then load back in, because I'm not having to talk at all on me. This character is so decked out with, uh... Charms that they left no room for anything else. A lot of time, I think you would also run Conviction. This character came with uh, the Redemption aura from Phoenix. But uh, this guy's strong enough in a player one game to kill anything. Anything that's gonna be a problem. Anything that's cold immune, that is. I didn't put my armor up. I just love the sound of those guys popping. It's like satisfying. I really love some of the new art 
for some of these enemies. Like, these guys in particular are really cool looking. You know, I'm wondering if something's changed. I noticed this on my orb video. So I've got negative 235% enemy cold resist. My understanding was this does not um, negate immunities. Oh. But I swear I just killed those frost immune. They were not getting hit by my merc, right? Like, here's some more. Look at that. I wonder if they've changed something or bugged something, but it definitely looks like I'm doing damage. And I don't have conviction, I don't have lower resist. I don't see how... I mean, I've got negative 5 to enemy cold resist, but I didn't think that was possible to break... Um, immunities. So if anyone's got any thoughts on that, I'd be curious if there's something I'm missing here. But I'm definitely uh, killing cold immunes, and I don't have, like, right there. The only thing I have is cold mastery and some, a couple of minus 5% to cold resist. Should I be able to kill these guys? I don't think so, but I actually, I think if lower resist and uh, a conviction is able to break immunities. I think that a high level gold mastery should be able to, just my opinion. But, you know, what, who am I? I actually would probably be overpowered, honestly, because sorceresses are already good enough. They don't really need, I think, any more help. I was hoping to run into, like, uh, Claw, Vi Claw Viper Temple or the Maggot Layer or something. Yeah, let's try it again. That's hard to tell because the Merc was hitting him. That is definitely doing damage, even my my ice blast. Now this is also from the alpha, and you're really not supposed to be in hell anyways, so this could just be something like the immunities are not implemented. But it's weird because, you know, it's just Diablo 2 running under the hood. It's locked. That feels so slow. See, even in, I mean, I don't think the art style impacts the gameplay, I, so I wouldn't think like just changing the overlay would change something like that, but it's good to confirm, even going back to old style. So, that might be something I send over to your Blizzard. I feel like I maybe should have thrown on some Mage Fists. I'm actually... could use a little bit more mana. Or not Mage Fists, the... Uh, Frost... Uh, man. I could not think of the name. The other gloves that give you plus mana. Frosties. Alright, I'm just going to play here for a couple more minutes. And basically what I've been doing is uh, kind of playing different iconic, kind of classic builds and seeing how they look and play in the Resurrected Alpha. Um, you know, it's been years since I played, like, deep... That's a dull room. Since I played deep into the game. And, uh, you know, I want to kind of get a feel for it again and know what character I want to play when this actually comes out. That's kind of what I'm doing here. I'm also taking requests, so if there's something specific you would like to see, if I haven't shown something, if there's an area or a character class or something, I'll see what I can do. I don't have, like, every character in the game, but, uh, you know, I can probably put something together. And, um... 
And if you like this, I've got quite a few videos already. I think we got about 20 up with different builds and areas and stuff. You might find what you're looking for. They're already done. Uh, beyond that, I've got a bunch of VR content. I've got full playthroughs and reviews and stuff. If you check out some of it and you like it, uh, consider subscribing. I would uh, definitely appreciate it. But I think I'm going to end it here. I feel like this character... I, I, it's a good character. I just don't love the gameplay loop around Blizzard. I prefer the shorter cooldown on Frozen Orb. Even if Blizzard maybe is technically better. Uh, I also like that Frozen Orb is not such a big skill commitment. Like, you can go 20 points Frozen Orb, one Mastery, and then, um, you know, still go deep into Fire or Lightning. So, yeah, I'm gonna end it here. Again, thank you for watching, everyone, and have a great night.